Hello everyone, welcome to the playlist of distributed systems. We will start from unit 1 that is introduction to distributed systems. From this unit at least one long question will be asked in exam that will carry at least 7 to 8 marks. In this video we will study about distributed systems, advantage and disadvantage of distributed systems and the application of distributed system. At first what is centralized systems? In centralized systems all calculations are done in one particular computer. It do not rely on any external resources and fault tolerance is not available in centralized systems. Distributed systems. A distributed system is a collection of computers connected on the network that work together to form a single computer for the end user. Here is the simple diagram of distributed systems where four computers are connected within the networks so that they can share their files within different devices. Advantage of distributed systems over centralized systems. Resource sharing. Distributed systems has the ability to use any hardware, software or data anywhere in the system. Fault tolerance. If there is some failure in the hardware or software, the system continues to operate properly without degrading the performance of the system. Better performance. Distributed systems can use the resource of multiple computers to handle workload, which can improve the speed and efficiency of the system. Cost effectiveness. Distributed systems can be cheaper than centralized systems in long run as they can use low cost computers rather than expensive supercomputer or mainframe computer. Reliability. If one node fails, then other nodes can continue to operate the system. Scalability. The computing and processing capacity can scale up as needed without affecting the system performance. Geographic distribution. Distributed systems can serve users in different locations as they can communicate over the network. Disadvantage of distributed system. Complexity. More complex to design, implement and maintain than centralized system. Consistency. It have to ensure that the data and state of the systems are consistent across the computers when there are concurrent updates or failures. High initial cost. Setting up or distributed systems require more physical resource and engineering time which can increase the initial cost. Security Every device can access easily so it is less secure than the centralized system. Network and communication failure Distributed systems rely on network connection to communicate which can affect by the network failures. Application of distributed systems Finance and commerce, online banking, e-commerce and payment platform uses, uses distributed systems to handle transaction, security and data consistency across multiple server and location. Information society, like search engine, Wikipedia, social networking uses distributed system to process, store and retrieve large amount of data from different source and provide fast and reliable service to the users. Entertainment like online gaming, music streaming and video streaming uses distributed system. Scientific computing. Distributed computing uses distributed systems to perform complex calculation or simulation that requires high performance and parallel processing. Education like e-learning uses distributed system. In transportation like uh, GPS, Google map uses distributed system. Healthcare example online patient record health information of patient and so on. Environment management like sensor technology to monitor the earthquake flood that going to be occur on future. Thank you for watching till now. If you are new then please share and subscribe the channel so that it can be reached out to many people. Thank you.